Morning everybody, Sunday, Florida, and I'm out here with the walkie with Bella. So today I want to discuss something I learned yesterday. Um, unbeknownst to me, and I do try to just kind of educate and help quite often, but here's the problem. When, uh, when, you're in, when you're in it, and you know what you do, and you do, you do it every single day, like every day. You do it, it's not a hobby, you do it every day. Like let's say, um, I'm in air conditioning. And I know everything about air conditioning. I know that I can walk up and hear a noise in the condenser and go, oh, that's the problem with this thing. And it's, um, it's technical and it's, and it's all this information and, and I know it. And then you got to go and explain it to the customer sitting at the table that's hot because, well, the air conditioner is broken. So there's two ways to do this. You can be technical and, ex and explain to them with all this jargon and technological techie stuff scientific things that you know because you do it every single day and then there's the um, second or third grade level that you have to break it down so the consumers and the homeowners actually understand and they go wow you're right that thing is broken we need to replace it or repair it when can we get it done okay so here's my problem let me, let me just own this and explain what i learned yesterday i obviously do a lot of financing um been doing it for a long time so to me it's second nature it's just in my blood um, i also have a software company called blue pages pro where we have this badass tool that helps you connect convert create more relationships ultimately close more jobs and then we integrate your financing into that tool okay that's what i do so what i realized yesterday in a post is that i may have the tendency to um, speak scientifically too much or too uh, jargony and I need to break it down and make it simpler for people to digest and understand um, so for that I'm sorry I mean I'm not saying I'm sorry like oh my god except my apology I'm saying like hey I realize it um, and I need to be cognitive and use the vernacular properly when I'm explaining financing I, I gotta do a better job at breaking it down so I'm gonna work on that this week um, especially from the stage that I'm going to this week because I believe a lot of folks that are going to be there speak Spanish. So I have to really concentrate on the simplicity and the words and the basics. So I'm really glad that I went through that lesson yesterday. So thank you, Andy Neer, for bringing that to my attention that, you know, sometimes I speak at a different level and I need to kind of bring it back down to uh, an understandable level for everybody, no matter what asset class you're in. So that's lesson number one. Think about that in your business today. Oh, most of you aren't working on Sunday. This week, when you're out there selling and helping, um, be thoughtful about the words that you use and how you're communicating the fix or the need or the want to the homeowners at the point of sale. Okay, so that's number one. Number two, um, with that being said, I... Yesterday I was on the whiteboard doing a video trying to explain this tool that I built called the APS, the Automated Prequal System. And I, <laughs> less, boy, this is a big lesson learned. It was a 12 minute long video. And I tried to post it and it was so long and I had it in 4K that it just, it fizzled out. <gasps> It fizzled out. It wouldn't even be, it wasn't even postable. Thank God. As I realized, 12 minutes is way too long to explain a simple concept. Oh, sometimes things just happen for you. Like this happened for me. So I'm so glad that that post didn't go through because people, I would have probably lost people like three minutes in. Probably like right now, four minutes of me babbling just to get to the main, main point. But anyway, um, I created a tool that will help you the contractor, no credit score, the debt to income, which is the ability to repay, margin integrity, and then ultimately giving you the recommendations on what lender and what product to offer that customer at the point of sale. Let me repeat. I've created a tool that pulls the credit report so you know the level of their credit, their debt to income ratios, so you know if they're going to qualify with their stated income. Margin integrity, which means what products and programs you're offering that you've built into retail pricing. And then what lender and program recommendations match that customer's needs best. The APS system. It's being released next week. Out of development tomorrow. 
and we're very excited to present this to you. The APS tool, automated prequal system, will be housed and put on your platinum plan over at the blue pages. That means that I've taken the guesswork out for your reps that don't know what to do when they're standing in front of a customer when it comes to what program to offer them. With one soft credit pull, without their social security, I'm going to be able to do all those things for you. Pull their credit score to make sure that they're, you know, qualifiable, right? Pre-qualified. Income. Can they afford the thing that you're selling plus all their other bills? Margin integrity. That talks about, I'm only offering programs that are under 8.5%, Chris. And then what lender... And what programs are best for this particular customer? Recommendations. Because between the four lenders that we have in our platform, there's 148 programs to choose from. And when I'm doing consultations, we're usually crossing everything off but four or five. So what is the recommendations once I've gotten this data from you, Chris, for my sales rep? And it all happens within a minute. This isn't something that you have to wait and file a report and then the report comes back to you. It's instantaneous. I built the intelligence and the model that I extract the data, pull the data together, put it through the algorithms and deliver the information back to you. So hopefully you've made it through to minute, minute five, five and a half to understand what it is that we're doing and how it's going to really help at the point of sale. Um, it's a badass system. I've been working on this thing for like <laughs> months in development and testing. So APS, automated prequal system, one soft credit pull solves the problems for you at the point of sale and at your office on where the heck do we take this customer? What programs and products are best for them to make the recommendation at the point of sale or the point of need? And how do we help that rep help that customer help their home APS that's it hopefully I've explained this on the most basic level and if I haven't I'll keep practicing because I'll I'll get better at this so I'll, I'll be better at thinking about how to deliver messages in a simpler way so everybody can understand what it is that we do here we do three things at blue pages we build really cool tools that help you connect convert create more relationships and close more jobs we provide financing and embed that financing into that tool and into your website and into your mobile app to help you close more jobs at the point of sale, offering affordability. And then number three, we help drive traffic back to your blue page and your website so you can help more people. That's what we do. Those are the three simple things that we do. Reach out to me. I would love to help you help your customers, help your sales reps. Get this message out there. Anybody that needs help, I'm here to build these systems so you can dominate your market and help more people. Have a great weekend. What's left of it, it's Sunday. We're out on the walkie. We'll see y'all soon. Take care. Bye-bye.